Hello my friends, welcome to Council Conquest. My name is Leonidas. Today we're gonna do something different. We're gonna try first time the new game, which is basically an infusion of EU4 and Dota War. You infuse them and you get Knights of Honor Sovereign. So, as you can see, there are a lot of starting periods, but I would like to start with the starting period because is you go to this one, the first one, the Byzantine Empire is very strong. You go down here, there is no Byzantine Empire, but there is a strong Nikia. But you go here, I believe the best scenario ever a small Byzantium. Who of Byzantine fans like me wouldn't want this scenario? So, without further ado, let's jump to the game. So, now we are in the game, as you can see, we have our, si our three cities here Saloniki, Adrianople, and Constantinople. And then we have this map here. At the game, it says the political view that we can see everything that's going around. And you may notice it's RTS, so we have real timing. Let's pause it for now so we can fix our empire. So, to go back, just double click on a city, and we are back. So as you can see we have stability modifiers, we have opinions, it's like basically the it's like the how, how every estate like us in EU4 imagine like this. Here we have our treasury, our money for archive and develop our provinces, we have our books, so we can teach I've our got the perfect now. plan. Yeah, I'm sure you do. So if you if you come here we can teach this guy, for example, for 200 books that give him this. I already knew that. Yeah, I'm sure. So, as you can see, you can uh, go click to your cities and you can build all the buildings we need. So, about the visiting situation now. We are in a very good or bad situation. The good thing is that all Byzantine enthusiasts will remember that Constantinople, Adrianople and Saloniki were, were the core of the empire, were the strongest points of the empire. All the wealth were accumulated there, so we have three big strong cities. And that's it, we just have three big strong cities. And one vassal here that I really want to get rid of, so we go to this guy, I'm gonna request an audience. We've released our hold over our vassal, as you commanded. Of course. Why I did that? Because they always get their stupid wars with their neighbors. So let's better give them a freedom to do whatever they like. So we can focus on other matters. And the matters are in the east. As you can see, this is the period that the Ottomans managed to take uh, Brusa and Comedia, which is here. Nikia. I don't know why it's here. It's be here. Anyway. And uh, they kicked the Visadins out of Anatolia. The world at your fingertips. So as you can see, we got the kingdom up. There you go. We have the Ottomans here to get rid of. And we have uh, another threats like Serbia and Bulgaria looming on the horizon in the north. But because of we have these three good cities, we can start playing tall basically. So if we go here to our troops, you can see we can take only peasants, but the peasants have horrible, horrible defense against against arrows. Arrows are the the let's say the first units that the AI take and the players, I guess, because they are very deadly. If you don't have shields. That's why we have to take a, a better level of troops. So for uh, for the next years, we are not gonna do anything, we're gonna get money and we're gonna get books, train our. Are you in need of train our, uh, our patriarch and our emperor, and then a general when we eventually have the upgrades and the money to make an army. So, after a bit of time and a lot of luck, we managed to finish our upgrades. So, we got the stables, we got the spear makers, we took the, sword, the swordsmith and the fletchers. So now, we can start building a great army. Look at that. 
I will get a lot of light infantry because they will be the backbone of our army. Then we can take a bowman and light cavalry. There you go. So now we just need to recruit a general and wait a bit to make a, a new a second army because the Ottomans, as you know, are a bit OP in every game. And I was unlucky enough that the center of trades, which they are moving here, they all accumulate in Kastanubul and Thessaloniki, so my income is double. I was very lucky at this, so we just wait a bit more to make an inventing army. Ladies and gentlemen, I present Should you we march? the Visadin army. We finally get a marshal. Let's give him some. Now strength. I know the art of war. Well, of course. My liege. So, as you can see, we have the Varegne Guards, which is basically Norse people, loyal only and only to the visiting king. We have our light cavalry. It's not the best unit, but it will work. We have some bowmen to, to make a lot of damage, and we have the core of our force, the light spearmen, which are. A medium, a medium game uh, unit, but we, of air, with our air force, we managed to have my it sword is game. yours, sire. This will literally destroy the Ottomans, even have one or two armies. First is second. These are the mightiest nations known to man. And as you can see, one is the Visadium. So by playing tall and only playing tall, we managed to to get uh, to the great power status only with the th these three provinces now let's start let's go here to the ottomans where is this guy let's and declare war our clergy's opinion has worsened why i'm doing a crusade anyway so as we declare war we are not gonna stop we're gonna recruit more and more people after we take the money for the general oh, actually we have Let's take. Now we have a merchant, very good. Now we don't have the money, yes. When we have the money, and we're gonna build the second army to reinforce the first yes. army. So this first army will go. Let none enter or leave this castle. Okay, and we're gonna go and siege Nikia. One last thing you have governors in, the, in your uh, cities. You can see this governed by the, the, uh, the emperor, this governed by the patriarch. And I drill by no one, so we get extra stuff. Let's take Marshal Zaharias. It is an honor, sire. And give him to gather Adrianople. What this means means that he will get bonuses here for the defense. Well, that's gonna be our defense on point because Adrianople will be all new producer. So, what we do? Let's go to Nicaea. And look at that, guys. We are so lucky. I found an an enemy army outside of the of Misia. Let's go and intercept them before they enter the city. I will crush these bugs. There you go, and they are balanced. All right, that's gonna be a very interesting battle. So let's jump into the battle. And now, guys, the RTS element of the game start. As you can see, it's more like more my life is precious. More Awaiting like orders. We can control the units and everything. So, what I'm gonna do? Spearmen ready. I will have them. Actually, that's a good position where we are. The Ottomans ambushed us, so they will come to attack us, which is great. So, awaiting orders. Uh, yeah, let's get our cav cavalry to support uh, here, so we don't get flanked. We have the cavalry Prepare here. Prepare to ride, men. And our general together, so these ones will just circle them and destroy them. And then we have the Ottoman force. As you can notice, they have peasant Levi's, which is, oh man, just terrible units and archers because we are still on the on early game. So when they come to us, we're gonna crush them with our much more leveled and more and, and better That's what units. we're paid for. So let's uh, wait for them to come and get destroyed. And as expected, they come crashing at us. They're flanking us! Ready to fight! Let's put on... Pierce them, men! 
to arms. They are in the best strategy. The battle. There you go. Horsemen, attack! I must be well protected. Attack with caution. To arms. He's here. So we already break that the lights. Spearman ready. They're running away. Our leader is under attack. Keep but your head we, down! We have this, this Awaiting death. orders! They're the cowards so are fleeing! We are being flanked! Yeah, you give Prepare to ride, guys. men! We're under attack! At your command! Okay, Blood you and steel! Ready to fight! Stay there. Kill the general. Spearman ready! We'll go back That's what we're paid for! Die. To battle! We'll destroy the funnel. They shall taste our steel! Hunters. Awaiting orders! Blood Kill and us. steel! Ha! The weaklings have run away! Ready Perfect. to fight! March on! So we just need to rout Watch and destroy out. their They're units! Flanking us. The enemy troops are losing hope quickly! Attention! We are losing our capture point! To battle! What? Oh! <laughs> because he retreats to their... It's Ready okay. to fight! Strike from a distance! Prepare to ride, men! Ready to fight! That, please, Move to I a better to position! Here. Attention! Reach and destroy! They are shooting at us! The cowards yeah. are fleeing! Now we just need to destroy their archers. At your command! Reach the spot before the them. enemy! That's why I need the cavalry. Ready to fight! Archers and archers only. Awaiting target! Reach that strategic area! Well. I'm in charge here. Come we on. are on our way. I only took one. Uh, the general and the boat and his bodyguard left. At your command, strike from a distance. Prepare to ride, men. Ready to fight. To arms. Oh, very good. <laughs> Attention. Awaiting target! Right! The enemy leader is dead and his forces oh, surrendered. Nice. We will destroy an army half or size more. So we crush their bigger fo force with our smallest, but bad news happened. The Knights of Rhodes have declared war on us, so. We may need to go to the defense a bit. This happened usually. Uh, to take of the three games that I, I played before, I was either in Crete or Athens or uh, the roads that they were declaring war on me when I was declared to the Ottomans. But don't worry, you have a big army to crash and they are minor nations. You should be fine. Unfortunately, guys, I have bad news looming in the horizon. The night and the Ottomans are together, look at that. They came together. The, the squads, we should be able to, to kill them for sure, but the problem is that they cannot be real forms together and they cannot be twice strong. My troops are. are waiting. So at least I need to have my troops full, in full health, which I don't. And uh, yes. you can see the manpower, I have only 2k, they have. 9k, oh man. What is your command? That's gonna be a close battle, but we should we have to win it. Otherwise, they're gonna take Saloniki, which is unacceptable. So let's get our Algerian force there and go back here. As we are here, Consider it done, battle. sire. Same like Total War. Ready. So let's go and, and uh, face them. And good news, my friends. So the battle started. They. they they meet us somewhere between the Thessaloniki and Adrianopoli, in the river stream on you know. And the Ottoman forces were just a bit ahead of the knights. That means we're gonna face the Ottoman first and then they're gonna be reinforced by the knights. So that means we have a very very good chance to win. Now as you can see the Ottomans just have peasants revised, that's it. So, same strategy again. They attacked us, so they will again come to us. So again, they just pop the head on us. Blood and steel! They're flanking us! So let's see how it goes. Take cover! That's a big battle here. 
At your command. To arms! Enemy troops are attacking our leader. Our capture point is contested by the oh, enemy. They're gonna take the Strike from a distance! Bowmen ready! Move out! The enemy is taking our capture point. Awaiting target! Spearmen ready! Attack here so they don't flag us. Awaiting orders! You're doing a very good job here. And, oh my god, they're gonna take our capture point. Don't, don't Watch out! They are flanking us! Spearmen ready! To arms! The enemy is cowering! Draw! Loose! They're running yes, away! Yes. Ready to fight! Bowmen ready! Halt! Release! Oh, we are on our way! Move to a better position! We, we are under order. attack! Awaiting target! Ready to fight! Strike from a distance! To battle! Oh, very good! We are being flanked! Move out! Our Basically, leader is we... under attack! We are on we our take, way! Uh... Take cover! Spearmen ready! Blood and steel! The main force of the battle with just... The cowards are fleeing! We are losing our capture point! March on! Here. Do not die! Ready to fight! Strike from a distance! Attack them from our close! <laughs> Move out! Run! <laughs> Reach that strategic Run. area! <laughs> Awaiting orders! My life is precious! Stop at once! We are on our way! Slaughter the enemy! Watch out! They are flanking us! They are shooting at us! Awaiting nice, nice. orders. Run, run. The enemy troops are losing hope quickly. Bowmen ready! Oh, we make them ready to fight! Place. To battle! Blood and steel! My life is precious. Very good. That's what we're paid for. To battle! Yeah, I think we, the, the battle is already done. So now it's time to face the the knights. As you can see, we are so, so bad. Oh man, look at that. Look at that. That's so unbalanced. But what I did, I have all my units centered here. And uh, awaiting here. orders. Here. Or leader. Prepare oh, to oh, ride, men. Here. Or leader is here. I must be on. well protected. You can uh, get bloody today. Bowmen and ready! What the uh, remainder of the archers here? So let's see how this battle will go. Oh my god, as you can hear the distraction. <laughs> oh guys, the weaklings have run away! Our capture point is contested by the enemy. Oh, guys. Archers, so either archers man at oh no, oh no. <laughs> I need my archers. Come on, guys, hold. They are flanking us! Our foe's morale is failing. At your command. Blood and steel! Hold on, get that. Yes, they're running away! Guys, <laughs> the weaklings have run away! The leader is a very bad save. Victory is ours. We've I slain the enemy leader. We won! <laughs> we won! We won two impossible battles. We killed the enemy king! Our army approved of our recent actions. Wow. We killed the enemy king, it says. Not just the, the king. Wow. So let's see. Can we take a, a peace with them? You don't want. I just destroy your army and kill your king, man. <laughs> wow. My sword is yours, sire. And hey, look at that. All units are are full, they just need to be reinforced with the map power. Okay, so I will reinforce my army and we're gonna be back.
So I did the change of strategy guys, we're gonna go and get Bursa first and then we're gonna go and get Nikia if it's possible and then we're gonna piss out the Ottomans, we don't have the army to go take Oh! They have... They lost the Ankara! Sardis! No, Agir is here, oh my god, sorry for my bad geography skills I got happy for a bit So we have Ankara here Yeah, they can... They can keep Ankara, no problem, I will try to Take uh, Brusa and then go to Nicaea, piss them out And then later If we are lucky we can sit Smyrna as well So let's see how this plan will go So apparently Brusa was very very big fort So we ran out of, <laughs> of uh, Totally everything, no supplies So I had to for be forced to attack them directly It should be an easy battle We have only a few guardsmen here and the castle, it should be easy and just like that, Bursa is back to Ottoman hand to Otto, oh my god, to visit the hands from the Ottomans so we have a, another problem though, we have a lot of war exhaustion look at that minus 6 stability because of war exhaustion, we can push it a bit more now what we have here Oh, okay, we take this. Army has no supplies, and we are a great power again. Great. Good day, sire. So, let's see. Yeah, we don't have uh, stuff to do this. Hmm. Now, we need 500 books, wait. Come on. Let's see that. I prayed for such a mission. Thing. Let's see if he's competent enough. So I have a news. I managed to make a, a, a treaty with the knights to end the war. And I ran out of supplies, so we can have Your a lot orders? of people buffs. And the Ottomans are just literally facing us. So I said, okay, let's make a, a peace for now. Let's uh, settle down a bit. Get our army back to Constantinople, Raxil to Brusa. And let's wait for our patria to pacify the area. And our five star Ecumenical Patriarch did it. Bursa is again Orthodox. But we have to, you know. To compare the Turkish population again. Should be okay. Let the sun always shine on you. Yeah, this guy needs to replenish the army, so I'll wait for the Levi's to grow and we can have an army here. And I have March, the second My general, troops are waiting. to go to Constantinople because this is a place we will upgrade to make a new army after we replenish the first one. And we we'll go to political view, you see, or Empire growing again. There you go, we have a foothold in Anatolia. So we took an empire that was defeated and crippled, but wealthy. In the reality, what happened in this period, the Byzantine went to a civil war, to a devastating civil war with, with uh, the Ottomans helped the, the, the Emperor win, and then they took advantage, they took Kabylipoli, and with this plot, the Byzantine Empire fell. But now we managed not to get to a civil war. We managed to get our things together and to even push them back, destroying two armies here with one, two armies here with one again. The knights are humiliated and defeated, as you can see, the rebels are sitting uh, as Mirna. And although we have recruited the whole Greek population of our provinces to fight to this war, we managed to take Prusa and the Ottomans are crippled as well. So I will finish uh, this episode here, I will make it a nice series like this. I will finish this episode here guys, uh, from this audio. I really hope that you guys like this is up. And if you have any ideas or comments, please leave me in the comments. Thank you so much, see you next time, bye.